Good morning, guys. How are you doing? Today, uh, Penzance. And it's 10 to 11, and I really, I really haven't woken up yet. So bear with me. be a lot of construction in the area at the moment. They're doing the uh, town hall up. Also is not awake. Oh, I better use my head here. We'll head out in Newlyn. It's a nice day. I was uh, just checking on a video I did yesterday. I don't know what it is, but my, my local videos seem to do quite well. Uh, you know, you know. I suppose I'm looking at it like you know, it's it's just around where I live or near where I live. So I'm not expecting them to do well, but they seem to do well, which is uh, pleasantly surprising. Uh, there's, a, uh, there's a storm about to hit Britain. Uh, it's a little bit windy today, but the wind is meant to be getting right up, so film, filming on uh, Thursday or Friday, our mullion, is going to be a bit fun. <laughs> as long as I don't go uh, near any of the cliff tops, which I don't plan on doing. God, it's 19 degrees, and it's still quite early yet, so there's hope. Go on, change. Thank you. Should be nice and quiet out round New Lynn, so <laughs> watch me eat my words.
yeah, so basically to, to reiterate, I was thinking quietly to myself there. Um, Thursday or Friday, it's going to be Mullion. I won't go down to the cove. Um, might be a bit too windy for that. Uh, Mullion, then back past uh, Cold Rose, HMS Seahawk, and then ending up in Helston. So that should make for a nice video, actually. Mousel! The locals don't say mouse hole, we, we say mousel. So it's funny to hear the tourists come down and say mouse hole. Oh god, excuse me, sorry. Oh. Right, snap out of it. Wake up, wakey wakey. out about this morning. Never really been a runner myself, maybe when I was younger, you know, but never really been into running. There's always tons of cars parked along here. You, want, you know, Mausel isn't very big, you wonder where, where they all go. Again, there's a car park there. I might park up in there one day and then do a little walking tour of Mausel. I've got a phone in my hand. Oh, look, a decent sized bus. Oh, he's letting me go. Thank you. Swear blind, that was one of the Bee Gees. Oh, look at that sea glistening. Try to figure out whether the tide's going out or coming in. Looks like it might be coming in.
in a way it's a little bit like St Ives. Very picturesque, narrow streets. Yeah, only enough room for one car. Single file. hanging out my window going, what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> there seem to be roadworks everywhere this morning. <clears throat> yeah, if you have a large car like I do, you want to be sure that you know the width of your car in places like this. <coughs> Especially St Ives. Things can get a bit tight. Alright, let's head back to Penzance. Go around the block. You can always tell when the tractors have been around because muddy roads. Speak of the devil, tractor! That's a big one too. I'm not messing with you. in that way. Time, uh, time for a shave, I think. Just caught sight, caught sight of myself in my rearview mirror, looking a bit um, bedraggled. <laughs> time to get the old clippers out, I think. See, the thing is, I, I hate being clean shaven. I hate having a baby face. I always like a little bit of stubble. Sometimes, you know what it's like guys, you just get a bit lazy and you forget to shave until you realise you look a bit like Robinson Crusoe. So we're a good 500 feet up here. And then we'll go once around the block, around Penzance, I think.
Oh, wrong gear. Must be weird living on a hill this steep. I mean, all right, I know the houses are built straight up, you know, not lent like the hill on a lean. But it must be weird coming out your, you know, your front door and the road is just going, falling down away from you. Odd. I think you've got right away, dude. Alright, he's gonna let me go as well. Very nice of you, that is. Alright, let's not add to the problem. Just have a quick drink. Really, Mr. Tesla there shouldn't really be parking up like that, not this close to a junction. I don't know if people are aware, I don't know if you guys are aware, but if you park that close to a junction and you get hit by another car, your insurance is void. Because you park somewhere you really shouldn't have parked. Bit of, a, bit of advice there, bit of legal advice. I think it's the same for a bridge. If you park on a bridge, uh, I think your insurance is void there as well. And from 30 down to 20. Another tractor. Sorry, tracker. Oh, this, this seems like the calm before the storm, really. Nice sunny day. It can get as windy as it likes, I just hope the sun stays out for Wednesday, well, for the rest of the week, really.
I was going to say, why does that man have two license plates with a nice little tow hitch? Tracker. Hey, watch that guy on the bike there. God. Hmm, really big tugging on the right there in the harbour. Having some welding work done on it. Work, work. Welding work. I can tell I'm waking up now because I'm talking stupid things. Talking stupid things, saying silly things. I think a bird may have just peed on my windscreen. The delightful. I just heard somebody go, hey, hey. <laughs> There's still a few tourists you know, down, out and about. Yep, I was right. Tide, tide's coming in, yeah. Right, uh, up round the back of Penzance, and go on, you've got a Toyota just like me. Took several hundred million years, but we got there in the end. Someone forgetting how to drive, I think. What does this pedal do? <laughs> hmm, I passed that guy in the beige sap down in uh, not, uh, not Mullion. Mausel. Come on, we can all go. Except me. So I'm not as chat, you know, chattative, talkative is normal, chatty is normal. 
I haven't woken up yet. Oh God. That's why the uh, normal amount of random rubbish isn't coming out of my mouth at the moment. <coughs> tracker actually that was in the back of a truck I don't know if that counts <clears throat> uh, yeah drifting into the middle of the road um, I would not like to be a passenger in that car. A big housing estate in there. And being down in Cornwall, you're going to expect they're going to be nice, big, expensive ones so the locals can't afford them. We started. Tracker! Green tracker! Back to New Zealand. Mr. Big Tip Truck is going Newlin as well. And there's his friend. Actually, I think they're the same company. They must be taking that earth and tipping it somewhere. Hopefully not into the ocean. Anyway, guys, I'll, I'll end this 
video buying the glamorous back end of a tipper truck. Lots of trucks. Um, I hope you like this little video. Uh, next time you see me or sit next to me, we'll be out um, Mullion. So that's the next place we're going. So until then, guys, like, comment, and subscribe. Only if you want to. And uh, thanks for keeping me company. And uh, hope the rest of your day is fantastic. Look after yourselves. I'll see you, see you again soon, guys. Cheers.